And now for something completely different. <laughs> this is a bit of a same day choice. Not a lot of planning going on here. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it. <laughs> it's been 20 years. Let's do a 20 year celebration. I don't know when the actual anniversary is. I didn't check. So full disclosure, I'm just really excited about Monster Hunter Rise. and I want to play it when it comes out. So, um... I would like to, uh, not be in the middle of something else, like a really long game. And so I was like, what What can I do in about 20 hours? Because that's about how much time I have until, like, in time slot wise. And, um, Yakuza 4 was not that. And, uh, freaking Pillars 2 is especially not that. So I was like, in the meantime, it's just so I can start Monster Hunter Rise on time. Let's try playing a short game. And... Something that's been on my to-do list has actually been to go back and play Golden Sun. Because this is one of the few JRPGs I have positive emotions about. <laughs> and I want to test them, I guess. I've always wanted to go back and see, like, would I still like this game? Or did it, like, wow me because I was underexposed to JRPGs and, and video games in general? Because it came out when I was 11 years old and I played it once on the Game Boy Advance, which was also impressive in its own ways. So I've never gone back and played this game since then. And like, I don't know, I have this feeling in the back of my head that RPG, like JRPGs used to have better pacing and that they used to have better dungeons. Like I think I think about how like, when I played Tales of Berseria and Vesperia, no, not, not Vesperia, I don't remember that one as well. V Berseria and Zestiria with a Z, there we go. Their dungeons were so fucking boring, you just run forward and do random encounters and run forward and do random encounters and sometimes you press a button to open a door and then run back a little bit and then go forward again like it's just it's basically just like a giant linear hallway but they like coil the hallway up to hide how linear it is by making it look complicated but you only have one way to go and like no thinking to do and i'm like didn't dungeons used to have more to them i think back to like golden sun and final fantasy 10 Final Fantasy X being the other JRPG that I played when I was about 10 years old and have fond memories of and want to go back to at some point. Uh, I remember both of them having better dungeons, and I'm like, at least better than fucking Berseria's nothing dungeons that feel like they're just there to pad your time. So I'm curious. I'm just I'm just curious to test this, because I want to see if this how this game holds up. I don't remember its story. I barely remember its gameplay. There's a few attacks that I'm that are really memorable. It's fucking music, though, is seared into my mind. Like, I love the music for this game. It's, 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 this is, this game is deeply nostalgic to me. This is what I was playing back then when other people were playing Final Fantasy and Pokemon. Although I did play one Final Fantasy at the time. Should we rename Isaac? Ooh. Mmm, that's fun. Oh, what should I name, what should I be naming Isaac? You know what? Actually, mm -mm. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna rename Isaac. I just remembered this is one of those older style JRPGs where you can name every single character. And that's a little unnecessarily confusing. <laughs> and and since we're not really necessarily role playing in a JRPG, I don't really feel the need to like cast ownership on them by giving them names. It was kind of highlighted was kind of highlighted by Yik a little bit, Y2K, where it's like we could name characters, but also why? Because you weren't really making choices in the game. They, they were their own characters. Uh, now, and I know them as their names. I think I renamed this guy to Keith when I was a kid. But everybody else, I think I kept their own default names. And I just know them as their default names. And it's like, this has always been like a feature that just kind of existed and made sense. Because like, hey, it's not a voiced game. You can just name people whoever you want. They'll just replace the word throughout the game. But, uh, I don't feel the need. Isaac, wake up. Please, dear, wake up. The Mount Aleph boulder is going to fall. Come on, Isaac, we have to go, now. This game has such a particular art style. Like, it, it tripped me out, because I, I think as a kid, I kind of thought it was 3D. And I'm like, how are they doing 3D on my Game Boy Advance? But like, I think it's just like a really specific form of pixel art that makes everything feel kind of bulgy and like they're a 3D model. I think it, I don't, 
I don't, I, I, I never checked though. It might be like Donkey Kong where they had like a 3D model and then kind of photographed it and then like put that graphic in the game. But I think they just did, I think it's just a particular style of pixel art. I think they just drew them by hand, honestly. But I could be wrong. Isaac, you forgot something. It's pouring outside. Don't go out without your tunic. We can't let you get rained on in the volcano. <laughs> Have you got everything you need? I... I guess. I don't know. <laughs> that, was a, that was an interesting little thing, though. Is, yeah, she used her little... I kind of forgot about that. Yeah, that's part of why the dungeons were better and had more going on, as you would interact. Like, she used her telekinetic thing to move something around, because they're introducing abilities here that are, that are important. Good for you, Isaac. A lost possession can be replaced. A lost life can't. Ooh, they're doing the weird full justification that fills the page so there's weird spaces. Isaac, Dora, hurry. The boulder could fall at any second. We are, we are a silent protagonist. Kyle, will they be able to stop the boulder? I don't think so. Not for long, anyway. You two go on ahead and take refuge in the plaza. Aren't you coming? I need to help evacuate the other villagers. Let me help you, Kyle. It's too dangerous, Dora. Please, just take good care of Isaac. Isaac is old enough to get to the plaza on his own. You can find your way, can't you, Isaac? Uh, yes? Don't leave me, Mommy. You know the way. Just go south to the plaza. Be careful. I don't feel good about that. I don't think their odds are... Oop. Oh, the... Gotta figure out the default hotkeys. They're weird. I don't feel great about their chances, honestly. A little concerned about that. Uh... So this will be a weird mix. It's a uh, uh, between like a deeply nostalgic playthrough and a blind playthrough because I don't. I only played this game once 20 years ago, so I don't really remember much of anything, including the like the entire story, or what happens most of the time. It's just so long ago. But there's going to be individual visuals and 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 uh, sounds that I'm just like, oh my god, it's that. It's a huge rock that Isaac's strength can't even budge, and I'm playing this on the Wii U. Because it's just on the Wii U, if you don't know that already. You just play this Game Boy game on that, and it's sequel. Which I think is like twice as long. It takes place in parallel or something. Isaac checked the jar. I didn't find anything. Gotta figure out the hotkeys. So the B button, which is the bottom one, is run. Pressing Y opens the menu. This will take some getting used to. I don't know what X does yet. It's like A also opens the menu, which seems a little unnecessary. Oops. Press. There we go. I'm just t testing all the buttons, and half these buttons obviously weren't on a Game Boy. I think the Game Boy Advance had two shoulder buttons, four face buttons, and a D-pad. So I get to use a joystick. That's nice. The lighting looks really good. What if the lightning strikes inside the building? Ugh. Ugh. Isaac, what do you want? I'm trying to save my things. What, you want me to just dump my stuff? Yes. You think I should forget these things and save my own life? You know, you're right. Okay, let's get out of here. Garrett, join the party. It's Garrett's chest of valuables. I don't know how he got them here. I'm not really sure how he got them here. What was this on the way to? It was it was it buried in over here? <laughs> it might even just survive, honestly. Garrett might be the reason why I have a, an ongoing RPG uh, name, Garrix, G-A-R-R-I-X, which I don't really have an origin for, and it might be his fault. <laughs> ah, the boulder, it's falling.
Ugh, it's too heavy. We can't hold it for long. If our synergy runs out, they will be destroyed. Synergy, psychic energy. We have to hold on until the villagers are safe. Wouldn't the boulder just stop moving once they successfully stopped it? <laughs> Hurry, boys, run! It's just a little farther. Oh, I was going the right way. They went up, so I thought the right way was down, so I naturally went the wrong way first to see if I'd find anything, but I guess it's the right way. Come on, Isaac, run! The boulder's coming! Like, oh, there's a staircase down here. Oh. We can't get around this rock! We'll have to find another way. Ah. Making sure you know that they can go between screens. It's a huge rock that Isaac's strength can't even budge. Uh oh. Rock slide. Destroyed fence. Monsters everywhere. Was there just a little fence holding the monsters back? I'm hurt pretty badly. You think I'll die? Wow. Uh, n no? This is awful. I'm left here for the monsters to. Wait, that's strange. I'm not hurt at all. <laughs> but I'm serious about the monsters, so be careful on your way to the plaza. Why would you leave us? We're children. I guess he wasn't very smart to begin with, given what just happened. <laughs> what, if he, what if he say he will die, and then he just does? Like, you're, you're somehow deterministic, you cause it to happen. Vermin appeared. Isaac's party attacks first. This is such a fucking particular battle screen. Yeah, this is the song. Isaac's battle theme is seared into the back of my mind. It'll never be gone. It's more powerful nostalgia than any Zelda song, because I didn't grow up playing Zelda. Like the camera angles. This game really trips me out with how they did this. Like I get, like they must just have a bunch of different drawings of every character for every angle. But watching it simulate a 3D camera blew my goddamn mind as a child. And it's still kind of, I still kind of like marvel at it a bit. I'm like, how, they, how is it working? Let's just speed up a bit here. I don't really have choices yet. I don't think I have any abilities yet, so I could pretty much just mash through these for now. I'm definitely looking forward to seeing some certain spells again. This is the first time I ever encountered the word Ragnarok. I had no concept, no context for it, and I misread it as like Ragnarok or something. Because you just didn't know these words. Like I remember playing World of Warcraft with some friends and we would all call it Eviscrate. Eviscerate. <laughs> None of us were reading it right because we didn't really know what it was. Oh no, my brother. Hang on, Felix. Felix will be alright. We'll find a way to save him. Uh oh. No, Felix! I really thought they went up and I was supposed to go down. But they're, they're somehow ahead of me, but down? Intuitively, in, the, in this kind of map, you would think the mountain is probably the up direction, right? The rope won't reach. We should use synergy. Do you have any left? Oh, he's holding on still. I've used all mine up. What about you, Kyle? You can tell I'm important because I don't have a portrait. <laughs> I'm drained from helping the other villagers. We have to get help. Can Felix hang on long enough for us to find help? There's nothing else we can do for him here, is there? Then go get help. But be quick as possible. Jenna, can you get help too? You'll go find help, right? Your brother's counting on you, Jenna. 
All right, let's get going. Can we do it? Do we have synergy? Wow, those boxes are so in the way they can't just walk out <laughs> off, off their deck. They have to go through the house. I'll go look up north. You head for the plaza, all right? Yes, ma'am. We're looking for anyone with any synergy left, right? Very good. Isaac. You saw what happened? Yep. I have to go get help before Felix drowns. I don't suppose... Could the two of you help me? Jen has gone to the plaza to get help. Go join her. There is nobody in that direction. We just came from that direction. Unless you're going to find the people that are holding the boulder up, which I think they might... I, I'm, I am confused by the logistics of the boulder. Like, surely... Surely they can just let go of it now. Like, isn't it... It looks like it's on flat land. A lot of combat here. Our child can fend for himself. He'll he'll figure it out. It's just the middle of a crisis where we have to save people, supposedly. I'm sure our child won't get in any danger. By the way, monsters are everywhere now. Um, <laughs> I may have made some mistakes planning this. <laughs> yep. I knew into this knowing that it would have random encounters, but I'm definitely going to be like, oh man, a little bit. <laughs> There's definitely the part of me that's like, ah, but do we have to? <laughs> I'm, big, I'm a big proponent on cutting the fluff. Because it is, random encounters is a concept. Once, you, they, once you've successfully learned how to play the game, and especially once they're like repeating encounters you've seen before, it is functionally just padding in every JRPG. Like, they're not even parts of quests. That's kind of a difference between Western and, and Japanese in many cases. It's just like the... There technically are random encounters in some Western games. But they're kind of just like things that are around that you can attack if you want to. Like, most of your battling usually is, is in the context of some kind of quest. But in JRPGs, it's often just like, I don't know, let's just fucking... There's a book titled The Synergy Stone. Synergy is replenished by touching a Synergy Stone. That's the whole book. Is there ever anything inside these boxes? That, that threw me off a little bit. So this button opens a menu, but if I... It's also my interact button. So it's kind of like double mapped. It looks like Y and A both do that, actually. That's interesting. Let's see. Yeah, I think I think battles should always be in the context of some sort of story. Otherwise, it's just kind of making the game longer. But it's like, it's like you're it's like you're having dreams. Like you're you're getting warped off to an alternate dimension, and just randomly fighting someone. You're like, oh, okay. Anyway, back to the real game. The moment it's over, like it's 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 so disconnected. Oh, I'm exhausted. I used up all my synergy deflecting falling rocks. You should get in a building. Or something. Just anywhere besides here. <laughs> uh, if you want to stop getting hit by falling rocks. Huh? Are you asking me if I can use synergy, Isaac? If I were ten years younger, I'd have plenty to offer. But I'm too old. They're doing the thing where everybody is like, What's that dog? What's that doggy? Garrick Garrick fell into a well. <laughs> like they have to explain what I'm saying because they're so insistent on silent protagonists. I always wonder how this became a thing. You expect an old woman like me to use synergy? Don't ask the impossible. All right, so apparently old people can't use psychic energy anymore. You just age out of it. That's kind of a bummer. You think it'd be really helpful once you're older? You think you'd get better at it when you're older? Like, and it'd be like a nice thing. Like, oh, see, my my body is. Is getting becoming frail and aged, but my mind as sharp as a tack. Look at the shit I can do now, and you, you probably become more dependent on psychic energy. But apparently, in this universe, you just kind of lose out on both at the same time, and it's even so. Aging's probably even more devastating than ever before. Jenna went out that way. That's like really. That's a. That's a bummer. No shop here, because no one's. Yeah. 
This is where the shop would be. But there's a crisis. You'd think that I could, uh, you'd, you definitely would hope I could like loot an item though. Because I, uh, I could use a little help with this uh, whole trying not to die thing. Oh, well, little Felix has fallen into the river. That must be why Jenna looked so upset. I, I am the dog. It, it, it is the, that was totally the line. That was just like, I, guess, it, I mean, we knew that already, but yeah, it totally is like, what's that? Somebody's fallen into the well? <laughs> that must be why Jenna looked so upset. She didn't even say? Why, why'd she run right past you without explaining the situation? I'm getting an inkling here. I feel like this is like a cave that I can access by by cutting that plant. I don't know if I'm, I don't know if that's like genuine memory or I'm just making something up. But I'm like, hmm, hmm. It does look different from the other one. If you look at it, the top of it's suspiciously like curved because the other bushes are all bushy, and this one's like, huh? What's up with that one? But we'll see. What is this? Oh, it's a tiny boulder. I have some sign energy left. See? Isn't that impressive? Wow, you'll totally save him. You will not. Go aid the elders. The boulder's too heavy for them to hold much longer. We can't let that Mount Aleph boulder destroy our village. Let's go help the elders. Wait, yeah, they're the elders. Wait, if they're the elders and they're good at synergy, then what's those two's excuse? What's their deal? Is an elder like 40? <laughs> and then the old people like are older than the elders? We're counting on you. Grandpa, Jenna. Garrick, Isaac, you came to help me? Jenna told me about Felix. Is that why you're here? I'm helping. <laughs> Good boys. Jenna could use a hand. Great, I'm all charged up. Oh yeah, the stone. How are you? Have you recovered your synergy? Enough to save Felix thanks to the synergy stone. Hey, that's what I just read about on that document. What a coincidence, it's the only book I've read so far. Okay, Jenna, you heard him. Now hurry back. Uh, the path may be blocked by fallen rocks. You two can show them the way. Oh, no, no that, was the old, that was still the older guy. Thank you, Isaac. If they don't have a portrait, it, then... There's also no name tag, so you have to guess sometimes who's talking. You can listen to the, the, the chirping, if you memorize what everyone sounds like. But I blew it. Yeah, things are suspiciously vacant, aren't they? a book entitled Etiquette for Travelers. It is rude not to introduce yourself to the town's mayor. Loser. Asshole. How dare you. <laughs> you gotta hurry. Can I go on that though? Isaac checked the sanitary stone. My pee pee is full. Oh, save anywhere. Oh, that's just so nice to know this is to have in this game. No usable side energy, they're both losers. Items? 50 HP, I should use it anyway though. He's only at half health. Garrett's doing way better than Isaac is. Yeah, there's like a there's like a slight blurriness to stuff and like a weird I don't mean the fact that it's an upscaled G Game Boy Advance game. I mean, there's like a there's something weird about the sprites in this game that I've never quite put my finger on. I did find it interesting that like they had that boulder which they resized, so it's like stuff doesn't have a fixed size. You can scale things down and to like alias the pixels or something. Because there was a tiny boulder that a guy lift that little kid lifted, and I think it was the same 
asset as the giant boulder up there somehow. I'm like, how do, how do some games work? Mom, Dad, we're back! Is that you, Jenna? I didn't accomplish anything. Yes, ma'am. I couldn't find anyone who could help. How did you do? I got this third one of the psychic triplets, apparently, that exist. You're just in time. And my brother is still... Yeah, he's right there. Felix is alright. He's hanging in there. Come down here, so we can save Felix. <laughs> oh no, the freeze frame. Oh, they, oh no, it goes hard. Did it just kill Felix and her parents? This is some next level fucking pyro class from this volcano. It's got like movie magic like targeted violence. Like it is it's aggressive. Oh, I I'll go. No. It's no use. I can't move, Isaac. Please get help. Well this only got worse. And Felix is gone. Everyone on the dock is gone. Isaac, the boulder. We need to get help, or everyone will drown. Mom, Dad, Felix, please, don't leave me all alone. No, it can't be. Kyle, it must be a dream. Oh, my parents are dead. My, my dad's dead. Probably. That doesn't... That does not seem- yep, this is bad. It tore the house in half. The whole other half of the house is gone. Jesus. Can't go inside. They probably didn't- they probably didn't make a torn in half version of the house inside. Welcome to your traumatic intro to this setting. Isaac. I can't let him go alone. Why is he sk weirdly skinny? It's times like these that we men have to stand together. I don't know what's going on with him. That was, I think that was a glitch. Oh. Only two of us survived. How could we have anticipated Soul Sanctum would unleash such fury? It's a miracle that even the two of us were spared. It's just Jesse and James. That switch, it must have been a trap. But to think it could con it could conjure up a storm this powerful. Another demonstration of the awesome powers of alchemy. Regardless, we must not fail the next time we challenge Soul Sanctum. Next time, we shall certainly... Isaac, wait! You were eavesdropping on us just now, weren't you? Uh... N no Me? N no N no Isaac. Isaac, they look scary. Are you sure we should be talking to him? To protect the world from <laughs> You must forget everything you heard. Don't worry, we'll help you forget. Beat up the children. <laughs> oh god. Uh-oh. That spin. Ah, it looks so cool. I can totally- I can probably see through the illusion, though. Like, it's probably just a, a big, scrolling 2D background that that looks like a 3D panorama. 
and then a few different poses to switch between for the sprites, but it's just, it's just, it's some cool shit for a Game Boy Advance game. I don't think this is gonna work out. Hey, a crit! I think that's a crit whenever that happens. Well. Well, that's all of our HPs. They were killing younglings. Well. Three years later. Could you imagine if it just like actually made me start the game over because that was not a meant to lose fight like what no get good loser you gotta beat those guys and you have to replay the whole intro every time if you don't <laughs> Isaac haven't you finished mending the roof yet you're almost done okay keep at it Is Isaac in Smash yet? I think it might be a trophy, not, a, not in the game for real. I forget. Yeah. <laughs> Still training, Garrett. Yeah. Watching people die that you couldn't help is probably a strong motivation. You sure to put your heart into it, Garrett. One R, one T. I think that's the only wrong answer for spelling Garrett, I feel like. Oh, I'm just finish finishing up. That's good. It's time to go, and I was about to leave you behind. Say, what exactly happened to you two? The accident three years ago. Is that why you've been studying Synergy? Oh, I was dead on, wasn't I? I appreciate your concern, but my family's never coming back. And neither is Isaac's father. I just want to forget that day. I wish everyone would. Oh, are they talking at the same time? That awful day. We went to get help, but they found us unconscious. Well, let's get Isaac and go to Craydon's. What, Garrett? Huh? You are about to say something, weren't you? Yeah, this game has people talking at the same time dialogue. Which is an interesting thing to include. Kind of impossible for me to read, unless I timestamp every moment it happens and edit it to overlap myself, which might just be more annoying to the audience than anything. Don't be weird, Garrett. Whatever. Jenna, are you mad at me? I don't want to talk about it. Come on! Huh? Isaac's waiting for us. But Jenna... I'll leave you behind if you're too slow. Jenna... You know, I thought you could rename every character in this game, but maybe you can't. Maybe I imagined that. Maybe I'm... Just thinking of stuff like Pokemon in Final Fantasy VII. That seems unnecessary, but I guess it's practice. Good job, Isaac. You patched it nicely.
All right, you're all done. You're very reliable, Isaac, just like your father was. What is it, Isaac? Do you still think about the accident? Yes. Hey, you still think about the time your dad traumatically died in front of your eyes a couple years ago? <laughs> I thought so. Isaac. You and Garrett have been working yourselves to the bone studying synergy. Do you think things would be any different if you'd had stronger abilities? Yes. That's what I thought. I was devastated when Kyle died. I felt all alone. It's taken some time, but I'm better now. I still have you, Isaac. You're almost 17. You're so much like Kyle was when he was young. I'm looking forward to seeing where your life takes you. Ma'am? Hello, Jenna. Good morning. Yes, yes, good morning. Well, if it isn't Garrett, too. Where do you all plan to go today? We're going to Mount Aleph with Creighton. Mount climbing, mountain climbing with Creighton, eh? Kids and their games. No, it's part of our studies. Ah, uh, yes. Alchemy. Alchemy is the foundation of all synergy. And you all know Mount Aleph is the greatest source of alchemy. They say Creighton is the best teacher around. Alchemy. I wonder what use it all is. Your mother would rather see you grow up to be a happy, ordinary man. But I suppose you still want to go. Yep. Well, if that won't persuade you, I guess nothing will. You're just as stubborn as your father. Ah! Be careful, ma'am. Oh! Garrett, don't! Oh. Why are we all on a roof? Everybody get after me. Oh! That was exciting. I'm sorry I scared you like that. Well. Oh, <laughs> sad face. Uh, I'm sorry, ma'am. I'll get you out of your way right away. Is his leg stuck? <laughs> Wait, not there. Huh? What's wrong with... Just remaking every hole. Isaac's work tarnished. Devastated. Oh, never mind. You'd better get going. This old house will fall apart if you stay much longer. I'll get this fixed up. You don't have to hang around here. Thank you, ma'am. Please call me Dora. This was a helpful place to have the conversation. <laughs> We'll get going right away. Wait, Garrett. Just... Watch your step. I like how the conversations are a lot of animated talking back and forth instead of, like, monologuing at me continuously. It's a nice change of pace. I told that clumsy Garrett it would be all right. But what am I going to do about this hole? Uh... Sounds like a you problem. Although it was a me problem like 
two seconds ago. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, there's how you know it's a Game Boy Advance game. It has a, a sleep feature. <laughs> All right, back to it. Back to breaking in the people's houses. <laughs> Is that your face? Oh, it's she has red hair and she's wearing a green bandana and she's facing away from us. I was like, what is this old man hunched forward with a green helmet and an orange beard sticking out? And he's got a little pink nose in the middle. It's like, that's the back of her head. <laughs> oh, it's Garrett's mom. You can tell she's important because she has a portrait and she has red hair. And it's like, ah. You and Garrett are older now. You can't waste your time fooling around. That's not the same emotion that my mom has. She just wants us to... Please have a normal life instead of this shit. <laughs> I hear Kraden as guests again. He's pretty popular for a sage. <laughs> the line spacing. Unnecessary. At the very least, visitors should introduce themselves to the mayor. Why aren't you wide justified or full justified or whatever it's called? Not left, right, or center. Always do left. There it goes. <laughs> there, now it's... I don't know why the, why, why the whole game's not just left justified like normal. There seems to be an appalling group in town that won't even do that. What's the world coming to? Garrett has grown quite strong in the past three years. Please watch over him. Garrett's parents. They have face portraits. Unlike Jenna's parents, fuck those guys. <laughs> they don't get faces. <laughs> Garrett, you make me so mad sometimes. Oh, it's, her, it's his sister. They're the only orange-haired family. <laughs> Your training stone crushed my flowers. You're in for it tonight. Just wait and see. Aw, sad Isaac. Can I just, like, push it? Oh my god, environmental interactions. I'll get you for my flowers. Just wait and see what happens. Tonight. Oh, well. You're in trouble now, Garrett. Your sister's really mad. Oh, right, because Garrett's in here. I have to rem remind myself that we are three people. <laughs> Jenna has no synergy. Garrett has move. Isaac has cure move and retreat. That's a, that's a synergy? It's running away? Yeah, so Gar so Isaac's clearly an overachiever because he's already got the ability to heal and do psychic powers. <clears throat> Isaac has more PP and Garrett has more HP. Jenna has the most PP even though she can't spend it. Great. Thanks. <laughs> oh, wait. They can map them to hotkeys. Nope. There we go. I just mapped a right bumper to move. Powers. I'm just crushing these flowers again. And I assume that took up PP? Yeah. Now I only have a Garrett PP instead of an Isaac PP. <laughs> veil vale stays pristine because of Mount Olive's purity. Taint that purity and you risk terrible retribution. You need to go past here? Maybe? I don't know. You must be going to Creighton's Cottage. Ruff! Oh, there's a herd of puppies. <laughs> there's some puppies playing over there. We should let them be. <laughs> this game's trying to... <laughs> <laughs> this game's trying to stop me from going the wrong way because the town's big and kind of confusing, so they want to make sure I go the right way and arrive at the right destination. <clears throat> so last time they could just have a rock fall down over and over again. I could have hopped onto that if it was over here a minute ago, but I couldn't get anywhere from there. You can, you can jump one space. But yeah, before it was a bunch Ah! Jesus. <laughs> ah -ha -ha. You're not planning on sneaking up to Mount Aleph, are you? Yes. 
Mount Aleph is a sacred peak. No one can climb it without permission. A highly religious town. Oh, it's the elders. But yeah, now they don't have rocks. They're like, there's a herd of puppies playing over there. You wouldn't want to interrupt puppies. Because <laughs> puppies are well known for not letting people play with them or pass them. It's like a Snorlax. Our synergy was given to us by the sacred power of Mount Aleph. Synergy is what grants the wishes of the chosen people. <clears throat> synergy is a power that should only be used for good, never for evil. What wielders of synergy are called adepts. Adepts are messengers of good, never forget that. The guy's got a really dramatic portrait. How was the art for this game made? What? That's not good. <laughs> they seem to know little of Soul Sanctum's mysteries. Well, we're right back to it, apparently. The Elders of Vale must not permit anyone to enter it, not even Kraden. Kraden? Can we use him? Hmm. His knowledge is no meager thing. We can use him. But he's more stubborn than we expected. And cunning, too. Cunning beyond measure. If he won't go willingly, then we can always... Again. You there, what are you doing? What are we doing? Were you eavesdropping on our conversation? Fuck yeah, we were. Oh ho! Well, I can't permit you to continue your spying. You guys are just really bad at this. You keep talking about your secret plans in public. Hey, you're the ones who were sneaking around. Sneaking? Who are you to accuse me? So Kraden's engagement was with you. Yeah, we're off to meet him right now. And this appointment is important enough to drive us away. Yeah. Pfft. If your errand is more important than our own, then... Go. Uh-oh. You're letting us go? Are you sure, Satyros? Minardi, we have no reason to delay these children any further. Let's... Uh, let's go, Isaac. Hmm. They want me to go in. If they want us to open the door or something. What is... What's in the settings? Window color. Oh my god! What freedom we have. Window brightness. Wow. You can change the speed of the message text. Let's turn off the speech sleeps. Auto sleep is set to off, which is good because I'm not... I'm not even sure what sleep mode even does when you're on a console, but I don't want it to start. That's always nice to have, though, those kinds of options. Go, children. You mustn't keep Kraden waiting. You'd better leave before we change our minds. Yep. Because he realized that us going is helpful to them, because they're clearly doing something with the mountain temple thing. And we're going to go climb the mountain, which means we're probably going to go inside. Just who were they? They already know too much about Soul Sanctum. Things that even the Elders of Vale don't know. And what were they saying about the elements? The elements of alchemy. Earth, water, fire, and wind. They plan to set them into motion. And the four elemental stars are the key? 
These are things that even I, a trained alchemy sage, do not know. Nothing in the jar. Is it? Oh, it's the same. Can I go over there? <laughs> they never removed this rock. It's still in this fence post. Do you hear those awful growls coming over the other side of this fence? You do, don't you? I... I'm scared. They never fixed the fence, but there's no monsters here. Somehow. <clears throat> Not right now, at least. Oh, can I go up here? Whoa! Screen transition. Ah! So past the fence is this cave. I don't think I see anything to grab. No. Sorry, the interact button is the menu button, so... Unfortunately, if I ever try to click on something, it'll open the menu. If there's nothing to click on. Oh, Isaac. And these fucks. You look like something's bothering you. Me? Ah, uh, well. It's those two, isn't it? Satros and Minardi were their names, right? Are they still out there? They're very persistent. Did they want something from you, Kraden? That seems to be the case. Seems to be. Mount Aleph and Soul Sanctum. They spoke as if they'd seen them with their own eyes. Isn't that strange? Yes. I like how the, the response picture isn't even a picture of Isaac. It's just some random kid. Yes, you can't enter Mount Aleph without a very good reason. And if they entered secretly, they might be thieves. We have to go tell the High Elders and the villagers. Wait, everyone. I still don't know how accurate the things they said were. We can do nothing until we confirm what they told me. Then what should we do? Well, we can go confirm it. You mean we should go into Soul Sanctum ourselves? Isn't that impossible? Why would it be? Just, just because climbing Mount Aleph is forbidden? Yeah, I guess. We're just going to see whether they've been up the, been to the mountain. Surely that would be acceptable. We'll be fine if they don't see us, right? No. Sure, you say no, but you know you want to. This'll just be our secret, okay? Okay. This is how you get peer pressure into doing bad things. Then it's decided. Let's get the events of this game in motion. We'll make you the leader, okay, Isaac? No. <laughs> there are some dangerous places between Mount Aleph and Soul Sanctum. So I'll take over if you get nervous. If Garrett's our leader, we'll be the ones who are nervous. Don't you agree, Kraden? You don't have to be mean. This might actually be the game where I learned that that's the- that's like the angry symbol in anime. <laughs> is that weird clench symbol. Because it's used constantly in here. This is our best bet. Alright, let's go. Everyone's got a little thing over their head. Is he a party member? No. He's a story party member. He's- he joins the Isaac Mass. <laughs> But he doesn't fight in battles, apparently. The, the Isaac Mass. It's like inside. Anything around here? <clears throat> I bet we just moved that boulder with our mind. The puppies are gone. They've been vanquished. Nope. Oh. Mount Aleph looks beautiful today. It's so peaceful.
Hmm. Cat? Nope. That's not the solution. I need a different power. Oh, this has never been repaired. Just this depressing spot still. This place looks just like it did three years ago, after the storm. Yeah, you still can't go inside. Is that guy eternally troubled by the fact that he was he wasn't there in time to save him? Isaac, watch out. Don't get too close to the river. Do you ever dream of seeing the world outside the village? Someday I'm definitely going to leave Vale. See, this is what makes me question this game sometimes. That looks like a 3D model that they like scanned into the game. But other elements of the game look like they were just hand pixeled. But I don't know. There's something very strange about Binding of, I Binding of Isaac. <laughs> Golden Sun. There we go. Jenna is the spitting image of her mother, whom we lost that day. I just want Jenna to be happy. My grandfather, granddaughter, Jenna, is finally happy again. I think you and Garrett are to thank for that, Isaac. I hope you two won't be taking Jenna outside the village with you. Cheese it, it's the fuzz. <laughs> That's Jenna's house. It was right by where the boulder went through, which is why Felix was there. Let's get back to what I think is our objective, because there's a lot of wandering I can do around here. It's a really spread out area. But they just kind of let you run around in. There's little hints here and there of puzzle things, though. Like, if I get the right ability, I can probably get that fruit. Really? Oh. This is the wrong way to go. I thought we'd move that boulder and go up there. But yeah, I guess we're just climbing the mountain, so we could just come up here. You're not planning on sneaking up the, the, to Mount Aleph, are you? No? Well, I'll overlook it this time. But I've got my eye on you, Isaac. Good eye you got there. Bye! <laughs> yeah, see, that's hand. That's pixel art right there. No part of me thinks, like, that's a 3D model they scanned in, like in Donkey Kong. But some of the other stuff I, I'm, I'm less certain of. 